<laughs> oh, hello, that's me. Um, welcome to the Geo Institute 2.0. It was um, set up about two hours ago, and it's much better than the 1.0, <laughs> which is mostly animated GIFs, that sort of thing. 20 seconds is very long. Okay, so deep in the bowels of the earth is this seemingly, beneath this seemingly innocent house, is where the Geo Institute is located. Um, it looks like a missile silo, doesn't it? Is that the OS New Building? This is beneath the OS New Building. That is the OS New Building, the red door. So I'll be taking you on a tour of the labs. Um, for those of a nervous disposition, um, I suggest you probably uh, loosen your undergarments a little bit, because it might be a, a little bit terrifying for you. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> Hello, yes, Geo Doctor. Uh -huh. A Geo Rat. I suggest you use Geo Ointment and see me in two days. Thank you. <laughs> okay, here we are. Uh, the, uh, one of our Geo Labs. Uh, there are not enough uh, projections and steroids and all that sort of stuff, so we have a whole team working on that. That is probably one of the fastest steroids we have. And this guy on the right at here, um, he didn't, wasn't very clear on what, uh, what a projection was, but lobster did very well. Um, lab discouraged. There are clearly a lot of orphaned uh, standards out there, and they need a directive to actually bring them all together. So in the, in the discourage um, directive, we've tried to bring anything, that any standard that begins with W, and bring them under one umbrella. The guys in the middle there are playing with um, IKEA furniture. They thought that was probably easier. Lab around the corners, they're working here on um, more APIs, because clearly there are not enough of those. Um, and they're probably a little bit too um, hard to use, so dropping any of the syntax. Uh. <laughs> 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 I don't know what to say about this, but what is that? Google Images. <laughs> There's something really wrong there. There's a solar power tie. This is, I'm not doing my presentation, that's great. Video, how video games benefit children? Brilliant, I love it. Okay, here's, some, here's um, uh, for those of you who wanted an augmented reality device, here's a, um, uh, what looks like a kaleidoscope, but it gives you images like this. It has buttons for highly sophisticated functions like buffer. And, um, and search and gazetteer and those sort of things. So uh, those are sort of what a geo warrior would carry in his in his uh, gear, ready for use. Oh, uh, lab Xanadu, excellent here. Here we've managed to form a cloud. We don't really know what to do with it. We've thrown data into it. It certainly holds a lot of data and it's cheap. But that's about all we know. Come on, it was. Ah. Lab Holy Grail. I think you'll see on here, there's, there's one here for um, RDF and linked data. If anybody can find a use for it, there will actually be that Holy Grail. And, and there's possibly one there for um, any, any database that can, uh, that can generate any product you like from that. Another Holy Grail that we're always aiming for. Um, the crowd. We tried the crowd. We found they weren't very wise. And um, possibly a little bit dangerous as well. So we decided that probably is a closed lab. We won't be using that anymore. Uh, um, practice, by the way, it always helps. <laughs> this is known as the Feldman Hall. <laughs> Any map we found has uh, been a little bit uh, wrong, a little bit uh, perhaps strange. A map of the Pacific Islands. Uh, I think you'd be very lucky to actually find any on that map. <laughs> this is a map of fairyland. And uh, here's, a, here's an inspiration, Nancy Drew. Ever lost a map? Read that. So it's not all work, work, work at the Geo Institute. Sometimes we like to track stuff, track cats, track cows, track pigeons. I have no idea what the uh, deal with this is. This was on some Esri site. Um, but most of the time we like to just put pins in maps. Brilliant. And um, yeah, for those of you with children, we like to do an outreach program about bringing up uh, geeks. And this is our alumni. I see they've dressed up this year. Fantastic. Um, as you see, they're, they're all uh, attractive geo geeks. Uh, the industry that attracts uh, those sort of people. So fantastic. And <laughs> Lift music. So yes, brilliant. We're here to serve. Um, hope you all join and become a member of the Geo Institute. Thank you. Oh, uh, seats and parents. Oh,